Brian, all right? What's happening? Yeah. Stopping you again, aren't we? Oh, get our fucking camera yeah. away from me. So, Jay, tell me how I can help you today. So, I've been suffering with back problems for quite a few years. There's just kind of this persistent pain that I get in my back. Um, it fatigues really quickly. So, my name's Elliot Reid and I am known as the Backcracker. So the first time I cracked the back would have been at university. From the moment we were taught it, I was manipulating everyone. So I'd be annoying my friends, creeping up behind them and just clicking their back just because I thought it was fun. Relaxing it completely. Oh! You all right? Yeah, that was great. The patient comes in and they come in because they, they, they see no way past what they're going through. They don't see a future when they're not in pain. And it's my role to see that future when they're not in pain and deliver that future by working with them step by step to help them to achieve it. There is no way we could have done this without Kirsty's help. This was the third property we've ever looked at to purchase uh, and the other two were also with Kirsty. So it's uh, been our little lifesaver really. It's hopefully going to set us up for the rest of our lives and we owe her a lot. I've probably spent about 20,000 on surgeries and like fillers, kind of a lot. So I got my nose done, um, I got a lip lift. A couple of weeks ago I got a second lip lift, a temple brow lift, and I think it's called canthoplasty, it's like eyelid surgery where they just make your eyes more streamlined. As you can see from the smile on the face, the fact that I've lost 22 pounds means an awful lot to me. Actually fitting some clothes and tie some collars, which is nice in work. I think the results speak for themselves, really. I do feel like I've rebirthed as Barbie. And thanks to Barbie, I'm now in a very healthy mindset. I can radiate positive frequency vibes to everyone, everyone, including animals that come near me. Yeah, it's amazing being Barbie.